We are taking off to explore Three, two, Huntsville, Alabama's most interesting offices. One, and lift off of Space Shuttle Atlantis. A final visit to enhance the vision of Hubble into the deepest grandeur of our universe. Hi. Has your chair ever turned its back on you? Have you tried to sit in your chair and it's told you? No. Not today. Do you want your chair to rise up to the challenges of the day, but instead it merely falls and leaves you unproductive? Have you ever been asked a question that you know that the person asking you has already known that you don't know the answer to it. Have you ever had Oreo birthday cake? Because I have. It's delicious. It's my birthday yesterday. It was good. Well, what's happening is a common problem that we see around here. And it's called, um, I don't really think it has a name for it. But the hydraulic lift goes out in your chair eventually. Um, it can take uh, one year, it can take you know, five years. You know, your hydraulic lift in your chair can last a long time. It will probably eventually fail you. People may think that they just need to replace their whole chair, but you don't need to do that because that's obviously a lot more money than a hydraulic um, a pneumatic uh, lift for your chair. So that's not going to cost very much. Um, and actually, if you get it from Wilson's office, if you've gotten your chair from us, it won't cost anything because we will replace your hydraulic lift um, ourselves for free if it's within the uh, warranty of the chair. So there you go. After you do this quick fix, your chair is going to be functioning just as new and you'll you'll love it again and you will not have to have paid another two or $300 for a new one. I'm gonna show you how you can replace the lift yourself in the next couple of videos. First, you'll need to prepare by grabbing a few tools and products. Um, you're going to need a new hydraulic lift, of course. You're also going to need a rubber mallet and a monkey wrench. You're going to want to flip the chair over and then begin removing the casters. Next, take off um, the base by whacking it a couple of times with the mallet. Then wrap your monkey wrench around the base of the old hydraulic lift and pull toward you until the mechanism loosens. Next, replace your casters and install the hydraulic lift and the cover and place the seat back onto the new lift. In some cases, you can remove the hydraulic lift with everything attached, but it may be easier to, to disassemble as much as you can if you're having a lot of difficulty with it. And that's basically it. It's not very hard. It's, it's taken us a few years to figure out a really good system of removing these lifts, but it's very doable with this system. So um, there you go. Hope you enjoyed that little Tuesday tip. If you need further assistance with your chair, please don't hesitate to call at Wilson's Office Supply. We normally fix chairs for our customers all the time. We get that issue all the time. So um, you're always welcome to holler at us if you need some assistance with it. Or if you've actually ordered a chair from us, we'll complete the job for you for free. Um, thanks for watching Hey Huntsville today. Hope you have a great Tuesday and see you next time. The deepest grandeur of our universe. I passed across the board, scooter, no action. Houston now controlling Atlantis on its way.